Hello everyone, Jerry from Coast Box. As today, we are taking a look at the Six Flags doing an off-season tour. Now, earlier today, they did a construction update on... They did a construction tour on the Joker, and they've been doing a lot of good stuff. They're, they're actually re, um, redoing the the exit and the entrance from, you know, where the bushes are, um, where you go from the carousel, and then it's across the carousel where the old egg, where the exit used to be. I think that is getting blocked off. And... And I'm going to show you this off-season uh, tour right here. I'll show you a construction update. Plus, Joker's Wild Card is getting renamed. Finally, Joker's Wild Card is getting renamed. And I'll show you their new park map act as well. So first off, let's start with the Joker construction update. Uh, so as you can see, uh, it's almost done, actually. The Joker is almost done. Um, um, I heard that it won't be opening till Memorial Day weekend because they have to test. up. Oh, there's trains. As you can see, there's trains. Yeah, so I heard that um, <clears throat> that the Joker won't be open till Memorial Day weekend. I heard. Uh, I heard. Um, so um, it will be. Cl it won't be open on uh, opening day. So yeah, and I'm planning to go to Six Flags Wing on April 14th. Um, so if you guys, if you want to see me there, feel free to go and. Me, see me there, so I'm planning to go to Six Flags Wing on April 14th. Um, so yep, yeah. as you can see, Joker cars. Um, here's some more Joker cars right here. Um, these cars look very nice. Um, they're like the same ones at Six Flags Great Adventure as the ones I saw. Um, on the commercial, I forgot what commercial, but um, but these look very nice. Um, so yeah. Uh, here's some more Joker construction update. Um, here's some more trains. Um, here is the Joker right here as well as you can see. They just need the lift hill, and that is just about to be set right there. And that's it. Um, so yeah, not bad. Oopsie. And then next, we will be doing this construction update. Um, so, uh, Mind Eraser getting new trains uh, as well. Mind Eraser getting new trains. Um, so, yep, as you can see, Mind Eraser getting new trains. It's It looks very actually comfortable. Um, there used to be a lot of head, head banging um, through it when I wrote it. Um, it was pretty rough when I wrote it, so... And actually, they're getting new comfortable restraints. Very awesome. Uh, especially, they're adding VR, and I think this will be better. I think the VR experience will be better than on Superman. So, yeah. Um, here's some more um, Mind Eraser trains. Uh, they were actually testing it. So, yeah. They are actually testing it. Um... And then I'll show you another park tour right here. So, I don't know what they're doing with this building, but it has something to do probably with Mind Eraser. Um, but I'm not 100% sure what is going on with it. Um, I think they're remodeling this restaurant. I'm not sure. They're doing a lot of off-season things this off-season. So, they want to make it the, bet, the, go, the, the park to go to in New England. Um, yeah, and I heard, and they're actually going to be changing uh, the entrance a little bit uh, to Six Flags New England. Uh, actually, the exit. So, um, um, they'll be re changing the exit. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I think this is where, like, season pass holders go. So, yep. Something. And then they got new benches as well. Um, they look comfortable. And then they have... Six Flags New England. So that is something to be cool. And then our next tour is Joker's Wild Card. Uh, Joker's Wild Card is actually going to be known as um, Cryotype. Cry no, Crypontype. Uh, Joker's Wild Card will be named, renamed to Crypontype. I can't say uh, the word. But, uh, here's some little history about Joker's Wild Card. 
Uh, Joker's wild card used to be inside the Hall of Justice, um, where it opened until 2004. Uh, I think the Joker's wild card, or well, the old Joker's wild card, um, but it was actually now Cryotype. Uh, Cryotype is now on, uh, was actually, I think, in storage. I think it was in storage in 2004. I'm not sure. Um, and then in 2008, Six Legs Run re decided to remove Night, Twi Night Twang. Um, they're one of their, like, old Enterprise models, um, t in 2008. And they put the Joker wild card right there. And then in 2017, you got the renamed Crypontype, which I can't really say the word. Um, so yeah, Joker's wild card is getting renamed. As you can see on the park map as well. So, and then I have a park map for you guys. Um, so, as you can see, park map. It looks kind of a little similar to the 2016 one. Um, it kind of looks similar to the 2016 one because you have the Superman the Ride symbol right here. But it doesn't say actually best new roller coaster in the world. It said that in the 2016 maps. It doesn't say it in the 2017 maps. And then you got Wicked Cyclone right down here. That is just you. It said uh, best new attraction in twice in uh, 2015. So yeah, but some uh, other models are still here, like Goliath, Sky Screamer, Fireball, and they used to have a sign for Thunderbolt saying 75 years, uh, and they took that down. And as you can see, the Joker. I'll try to zoom in a little bit. Um, Uh, I'll try to zoom in a little bit. Here you go. So here is the Joker. Uh, new for 2017. Um, and I don't know what they're going to do with Slingshot. Because Slingshot looks, it's still up here. Um, I don't know. It looks like they're going to keep it in that same spot. But that's pretty surprising if they do that. Um, if it is still going to be in that s slot right there. Um, and then you also, and I heard that actually that joke, the Joker's entrance is actually going to go right next to Batman. Um, right, right. If you go through like the swings area, um, no, actually like, not like when you go through the swings, but if you go through like the swing, like, um, around the swings, that's where you're going to find the Joker, uh, Q line. So not like, you know, you know, the long way, like you go toward Mind Eraser and then go to a right, like this way. But it's actually going to be right here, so, yeah. And then you got some other stuff coming to Hurricane Harbor, too. Like, they're actually re uh, remodeling one of the restrooms there. So, yeah. Um, next up, we're going to take a look at, um, for stuff here, we're going to just take a look at that. Um, we also have, sorry, my phone is, uh, the phone is ringing. That's our house full, uh, our house phone. Uh, I apologize about that, but, uh, first up, we have, um, uh, we have, uh, Looney Tunes Movie Town, which I wanted to check it out, um, which Speed Trap is actually still on here, and this is a 2017 map, and Speed Trap, I heard, is actually gonna be removed, um, so, and the restroom there, they're just remodeling a restroom, and, they made a big mistake on a uh, couple. They make a couple mi mistakes on the map. Uh, Spe Speed Trap is actually gone. Um, Speed Trap is no longer at, at Six Flags New England, so they took that out. Um, and I'm not 100% sure what they're gonna do with Slingshot, which is right here. So I'm not sure what. Uh, I'm not sure what they're gonna do with Slingshot, uh, as you can see. I don't know if they're going to remove it or put it in storage. I think the better way is to put it in storage in case, like, if it, if a big attraction, like a huge space attraction, uh, removes there, um, then it could probably fit in that area. But as you can see, Slingshot and Crime Wave are, like, in that same area and the teacups. So they're all in that same plot of land. Um, and I heard, and the Joker will be a big difference. So, uh, I'd like to hear from you of what do you think about this 2017 off-season. Um, off-season, I'd like to hear in the comment section below of what do you think about all of this. 
if you like it or not. Um, so please post your likes, post your comments as well. If you want to learn more about Coast Box, don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Alright, I'll see you guys soon.